Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be doing a pack with me. So I'm going to share with you guys some tips and tricks that I use when packing for vacation or for any occasion. This pack with me is going to be a little bit of a vlog style. So if you guys want to see how I pack for trips, then yeah, let's go ahead and get started with packing. So the first thing that I always like to make sure is that my outfits are picked out and ready to be packed. I have my accessories near it as well. So this is basically all the things that I need to organize and put in the suitcase and I like doing this because it saves me a lot of time so that when you pack you don't have to worry too much about um, you know what you're gonna wear and stuff you have everything nice and ready so these are all the outfits that I'm taking so literally all I have to do is grab them fold them and put them in the suitcase but I'm gonna show you guys some of my organizational tips okay so this is our maleta Eric already packed so basically I know how much room I have in here. So I'm gonna start off with the clothes because I think the clothes is like, you know, the biggest stuff. And I wanna start with the biggest things to the smallest things. So we're gonna go ahead and bring the clothes down that I show you guys is hung up because that's basically what I'm gonna be taking. So that's all the clothes I'm taking. I'm basically going to be using these packing cubes to place all of my stuff in here so that I can be most efficient as possible and I can fit as many things as I want. All right, so I think I'm gonna start with tops and I'm gonna put all of my shirts in this packing cube. So the key is to like roll it as much as you can to have it nice and small and then just stuff it in there. So that's top one. This is packing cube number one. It has all of my shirts and my dresses in here. And I still have a lot more room in case I need to put more stuff in here. So for now, I'm gonna put it aside. Now I'm gonna use the next one for bottoms. I'm also gonna fit some Spanx in here because you never know when you need a good old pair of Spanx. So that's basically it for my bottoms. So we're going to zip this up. This is all my bottoms. If you can't already tell, there's a very similar color scheme. Blue, white, and beige. <laughs> Those are like my summer colors. So that goes over there. Now I'm gonna use this one to go put my swimsuits in. It kind of helps that I keep my swimsuits in this little uh, cube organizer anyway. So I literally just have to place them in here. I'm gonna show you guys the swimsuits that I'm taking. I'm taking this nice beige cream suit from Forever 21. I think I'm gonna wear this most. And then honestly, the rest of the suits you probably saw in my bathing suit haul, which I'll link down below. I have just a classic black suit, which I think is perfect for any vacation. Then I have these nice high-waisted striped ones. This is from Boho. Then I have my high-waisted black ones. These are from Target. Black bottoms. And then I have this orange one piece. Orange, red, hot red, one piece from Forever 21. And then I have this black top, which I can wear with a lot of my bottoms. That's basically all the swimsuits that I'm taking. So that's all done. I think I'm gonna put in here this random belt that I'm taking from one of my outfits, just because it fits in here. So I'm just gonna cram it in here. And then this box is done. So now for the other cube, I'm gonna go ahead and put my shoes in. I'm literally only taking two, three pairs of sandals. So hopefully they all fit in here. So these are the three main shoes that I'm taking. So I'm gonna try to fit all of them in here, which I think I can since they're sandals. They're, uh, some of them are new. So I'm taking these like super classic flip-flops, just black flip-flops that I know can come in handy. I'm taking these sandals from Forever 21. So. I'm gonna slip them in together, put them like that. I'm taking these slides from Target, and they're just this basket woven type style, which I think is gonna look nice in, at the beach. So 
popping this one on the side pocket right here. And then last but not least, just these white slides, putting them on top of there. So this basically all fits. I think I'm gonna go ahead and add on my, my black Birkenstocks. Birkenstocks, they're not real Birkenstocks, they're from Target, but I think I'm gonna pop those in here too. And then those are all the shoes that I'm taking. So shoes are done. All the undies and my bras fit in here. And these things are lifesavers. So that's done. Now I just have to do PJs. Which I think I can fit my PJs in here. So these are the PJs that I'm taking. They're just some matching sets that I have. So I'm just going to pack these because they're just like the easiest to travel with. Um, I feel like if I take anything else, they're super thick and it might take up more space than I want it to. So I'm just going to stick to these, which is... Just two for four days, I think is enough, honestly. PJs are done. So all of my clothes is basically packed. Now I'm gonna move on to accessories, um, jewelry, skincare, makeup, all that stuff, which I feel like is the hardest stuff to pack because they're so delicate. You just have to be super aware of how you pack them. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and get started with packing our makeup. And for makeup, I use this clear bag right here. I don't remember where I got it from, but it's just super convenient because I can see all my makeup and it's easier to travel with because you don't have to be digging through your stuff to figure out where your things are. They're all packed in here. The way I like to pack my makeup so I don't forget anything is I start with the first step of makeup and then move on and on and on. So the first thing I usually do are my brows. So I'm going to pack my brow pencil, which is this NYX brow pencil and I'm in the shade Ash Brown. So I literally just throw everything in here. After brows, I usually go in with any type of... Um, Primer, so I'm gonna pack my Angel Veil primer, my MAC strobe cream, and then I'm gonna pack my foundation. So again, I love this L'Oreal Infallible one, this um, It Cosmetics CC Cream. I also like to pack one shade lighter than my actual shade right now. In case I get super dark on vacation, I still have a foundation that I could use. So I'm gonna pack an additional uh, Infallible. After that, I go with concealer, which is my Too Faced Born This Way, my Tarte Shape Tape. I'm also gonna do my Instant Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. Then I'm gonna go in with setting powder, which I use this Cover FX one, but I don't think I'm gonna need a lot of setting powder because I'm not gonna be setting that much. So we're taking that just in case. After setting powder, I set my whole face. So that's my Sephora Micro smooth after that i go in with highlights so i'm going to be using my elf liquid highlight and my anastasia beverly hills highlight i'm gonna pack these two after highlight go in with bronzer i'm gonna use my la girl pro concealer also my sephora bronzer and also my hula bronzer just you know can never be too bronzed on vacation also gonna go with some blush this is like my signature blush the tarte party blush and then after blush i go in with lips so i'm gonna do my signature lip so these three this is urban decay vice in 1993 anastasia beverly hills liquid uh lip gloss and butterscotch then my maybelline lipstick in 650 nude embrace these are like my three staples i'm also going to put a travel size eyeliner in there and also my lip pencil from nyx this is in the shade natural i'm also going to go ahead and pack a sharpener so throwing that in there and then i have my mascara this is my l'oreal telescopic then i'm gonna i'm gonna pack one pair of lashes i don't even know if i'm gonna wear lashes on this trip but i'm gonna pack some just in case we do something fancy the way i pack my lashes is i just keep the packaging and i just pop it right back on so they're nice and protected so lashes and then am i missing anything else i'm not sure Oh, my setting spray, of course. My e.l.f. Coconut Mist. I'm also going to be taking my uh, lash glue. So I'll pop that in there. And that's basically it for makeup. So this is what my makeup bag's looking like. Now I need to pack the brushes and the tools that I use. For brushes, I like to use this little tool here that has like all these brush holders. It's obviously very dirty because you store brushes in here. So... Brushes are usually dirty, you know, so I'm just going to pack all my brushes, my highlighter brush. Um, when I'm on vacation, I generally don't do eyeshadow, so I'm not even packing any shadow brushes. My powder brush, my blush brush, 
my stippling brush and my bronzer brush, concealer brush. Then I'll pack some tweezers just in case. So these are basically all the brushes that I take. It's not that much. It's just like my essential brush brushes that I use every day. So I'm going to go ahead and roll this up. And I love it because it closes like a little notebook. So it's very like convenient. When I travel, I usually like to buy a new blender. I refuse to use beauty blenders anymore because mine broke on me. Like, let me show you guys. It's like literally ripped. And for 20 bucks, that's just not worth it for me. So I'd rather buy these. But for a trip, like a fresh trip, I want to make sure that, you know, I have a clean one. And what I love about this bag is basically all of this fits in here. So in one bag, I have my makeup and my brushes, which is basically all of my makeup. So makeup is done. Now I'm going to move on to accessories like earrings, um, bracelets, rings, all that good stuff. So when it comes to um, my jewelry and stuff, I like to use this little uh, packing thing, which basically has an area to hang all of your uh, necklaces and then you can put like any watches or anything in here also has a little pouch and then it also has a ring holder right there and then these are earring holders and it's just super convenient because it has a place for everything so I'm going to basically replace all of the jewelry that's in here and I'm gonna put it in this little booklet thingy I love necklaces I feel like necklaces are the main thing that I'm gonna be wearing so I love this guys look you literally just undo the buckle and then you buckle it back up and your necklace is hanging. And you can even put it in here so it's more protected. These little clips I'll just put here like that. So this is what my jewelry looks like all packed. I have all of my necklaces here. I have some clips here and then all my um, earrings. I don't have any rings or anything so this is all set. Makeup's done and jewelry is done all right so now we're going to get started with skincare and these are things that i'm going to be packing that i need for my skin on the trip the way that i do skincare is again i start with the first thing that i do at night so the first thing i do is take my makeup off so i need to pack my makeup remover which is this one the uh garnier micellar cleansing water and i'm using another clear little pouch this one's a little bit dirty but you know what i try to clean it as much as i can because i used to use makeup in here but now this is for my skincare stuff. So I'm putting my uh, makeup remover and then after I do makeup remover, I cleanse my face. Take my travel size Cetaphil cleanser. After I cleanse my face, I tone. So I'm taking my Witch Hazel facial toner, applying that in here. I also do my Kiehl's Midnight Recovery at night. So I'm gonna um, pack that too. I'm also going to be taking my Pixi Glow Tonic toner and i'm also taking my facial sunscreen so all that is going in here um so i'm also going to be taking my eye cream in here i'm also going to be taking my face mask so that's basically everything that fits in here so now i have to move on to like another pack for the rest of the stuff so for the larger things i'm going to be using this little uh cube which says pack well on it and this is more so for things that aren't travel size that kind of have to go into the luggage i'm going to be putting my uh, Clinique moisturizer. I'm also going to be putting the cotton around. I'm also going to start packing like my um, shower things, like the things I need for the shower. So for example, I'm going to pack a comb. But this is the wet comb that I use. It's really good to use when you wet your hair. I'm also going to pack my deodorant. This is my native deodorant in the cucumber and mint. Also going to be packing my loofah. This is like my travel loofah. So I'm going to place that in there. For shampoo, I need to transfer over my purple shampoo into a travel case because I don't really need that much and I don't want to pack like this huge thing. So I'm going to take about that amount. I like that these travel things are see-throughs and this is the conditioner that I'm gonna be taking. It's Nexus conditioner. I'm also going to be packing my Good Stuff uh, Complete Repair Balm. This is for my ends so that they don't get too like dried up. So I'm just gonna take the full size. I'm also going to be packing a headband for when I do my skincare. I'm also gonna pack a fresh razor. And then in here I have like my travel Q-tips. I'm also going to be packing my travel toothpaste and then this is like the travel toothbrush that I like to keep for when I travel. All this is done. 
So this bag is all packed. These are more so shower things that are much larger that I need to put in the bigger luggage. So the, that goes in here. And then this is all like skincare, travel size things that can go in my carry-on. Um, so yeah, that's basically skincare, shower things, and I think I'm done. I'm actually not done. This is what our suitcase looks like because I basically put on all the accessories on top. But under here are like the hats and then the cubes and everything. So this is how it looks. The goal is to try to get this thing to close, which I think we can do. Okay, let's see. We got this. The big bag is done. Now the last thing that I need to pack is my carry-on and these are more so like my essential things that I want to take on the plane. So so this is my carry-on. It's this big black bag right here. I like it because it's very spacious but you need to, I need to be like very organized in the way that I put my things in here. I'm going to start by packing my electronics. I like to pack my electronics and my chargers and cameras and stuff like that in here. So I'm going to get started with that first. Okay so I'm going to pack my f50 lens this is the lens that gives like my pictures that blurry background i lost the lens cap so i like to keep it in this case i'm also going to pack my moment lens and this is kind of like a lens that you attach to your cell phone um and i think i'm going to be using this for the majority of the trip but i really like this because um it captures like a wide angle through your iphone so i really love that i'll pack my laptop charger the next thing is this adapter right here and this is for sd cards um so my laptop can read it so i'll put that in here as well so then i'll also put in my camera charger in here and this is perfect everything fits in here i'm so happy this is basically all my electronics this is the lens the charger charger moment lens lens cap a phone case for the lens sd card adapter and my two headphones and this is basically all I need for um for my electronics so so this is definitely the first thing that goes in the suitcase the next thing I'm going to pack are these masks the sheet masks because I want to do some skincare on the plane so I'm going to apply that on here I'm also taking these wet wipes then I'm taking my skincare because I might do a little bit of skincare on the plane like I mentioned and all of these are travel size so they're great for that I do want to take this which is uh just like a spritzer it just smells really nice I got this from Old Navy tied to go because you never know another travel fragrance I'm also going to be putting in here my sunglasses for the trip just because they feel much safer in my carry-on. I don't want them to break on the big like check-in bag, so I'll put that there. I still want to take my agenda because even though there's no working um, on vacation, I this is just my life and I love carrying it around. My pencil pouch. I'm also taking my laptop and I know it's so dangerous. I don't have a case on it, but um, it'll find cushion amongst everything else in here final thing i'll put in my carry-on is whatever book i'm going to be reading either on the plane or um, on vacation which i think is going to be this one the emotionally healthy spirituality so i'll place that in here and that completes my carry-on nice and packed <laughs> so this is everything packed up my big luggage where eric and i are sharing our clothes and then the small uh, carry on bag and that's basically it. So that's basically it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this mini vlog slash packing with me um, vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll try my best to link everything down below that I used to pack. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Oh, you're packing in those things? Yeah, I got them from Amazon. So it's helping me a lot. Look, all my shoes fit in here. I should have gotten you some. I love you. I love you too, my friend. You're the best. Today was fun. Today was fun. Hold up. They don't love you like I love you. Slow down. They don't love you like I love you. Back up. 
They don't love you like I love you. I'm also packing my... So, literally just... Oops, not that, not like that.